Good morning. I'm Rev Myron. I'm a minister through Pathways of Light. And I'm, of course, a miracle student and have been for the last 40 years. Um, one of the things that I do is um, I read the lessons every, every day. I've been doing this for several years now. The first time, of course, I did it just as Jesus asked us to do. And that's important uh, that we do that. But now when I go through it, I just ask him to clarify for me. Um, just help me to see whatever I need to see today. And so that's what I'm doing uh, in these um, uh, recordings. I'm sharing this with you. So thank you for watching the video and for being here with me with this lesson. So today's lesson is 353. My eyes, my tongue, my hands, my feet today have but one purpose, to be given Christ to use to bless the world with miracles. Father, I give all that is mine today to Christ, to use in any way that best will serve the purpose that I share with him. Nothing is mine alone, for he and I have joined in purpose. Thus has learning come almost to its appointed end. A while I work with him to serve his purpose. Then I lose myself in my identity and recognize that Christ is but myself. My day is quite busy. <laughs> Besides doing my work as usual, I have a family gathering to cook for and then to join. On top of that, I didn't sleep well, but none of this affects the day's lesson. In spite of all I do, my purpose remains strong and certain. I will be the love that I am while I accomplish what needs to be done. This body and this mind are dedicated to his use. As it says in the lesson, oh, while I work with him to serve his purpose, then I lose myself in my identity and recognize that Christ is but myself. I have let go of the desire to run my life separate from spirit. I'm allowing the self-will and self-identity to fall away as I welcome the healing of my mind. This is going to lead to a complete loss of the <clears throat> me I have been so attached to and a complete relinquishment of the idea of a separate will, a separate self. It has been a long time coming, but it must be closer because I've learned that this is not something to dread or be afraid of. In fact, I long for it. I can even begin to imagine it. And before I could not. I used to think I would have to sacrifice everything to give God what he wants. And now I think that I will sacrifice nothing to be what I am. I'm going to relinquish pain and suffering for joy and peace. <laughs> I'm going to let go of this little self will for the divine will. When does this happen? How does it happen? I don't know. Today, I will be God's teacher. I will be the hands and feet of Christ so that I can be used for the awakening. I will notice any resistance so I can let it go. I will learn surrender on a deeper level than before and be glad of it. Today, I will be available to Christ. One day, I will know I am Christ. So thank you so much for being here with me today. And uh, if you enjoyed this, and please like it and maybe subscribe. And I will talk to you tomorrow.